Welcome back, Alfred. How can I help you? I talked to Bellerophon and I asked him for the golden bridle. He'll only give me the bridle if I help him climb Mount Olympus. It's not easy to climb Mount Olympus, my dear Alfred. There's no way you can scale the mountain with your bare hands alone. You can but fly to its top. Fly? Is that what you just said? Exactly. Read the book Around the World in 80 Days. Look for Mr. Phileas Fogg and ask him to tell you how to build a hot air balloon. It will easily take you to the top of Mount Olympus. Are you sure this is a good idea? I am, Alfred. Trust me. Go now. Waste no time. Bear my words in mind. I'm sure they will help you. I have no further questions for... Go now! The black powder has spread to the book. I'm afraid of what might happen if I touch it. Oh no! I'm afraid I'm too late! The wasteland all around me must be caused by oblivion. A strange black substance. It must have to do with oblivion. I'd rather not touch it. I don't know what that strange substance could be. The sign of what must have been a shop once. Fogg's house. This must be where Mr. Phileas Fogg lives. Judging from what the inscription says, it must be Mr. Phileas Fogg's house. Hello, how can I help you? Are you Mr. Phileas Fogg? I'm not. I'm Passepartout, Mr. Fogg's valet. Can I speak to Mr. Fogg? Mr. Fogg is not in the mood for talking. But it's really important. It's a matter of life and death. Mr. Fogg is not in the mood for talking. How weird. He looks like he's been hypnotized. Hello, how can I help you? What happened to the city? How did it turn into a wasteland? Wasteland? London's always been grey and gloomy. It's no surprise to me. How weird. He looks like he's been hypnotized. What's that black substance all over the streets? Black substance? London's always been a very dirty city. It's no surprise to me. Can I speak to Mr. Fogg? Mr. Fogg is not in the mood for talk. I insist. I can't go back home. Not before speaking with Mr. Fogg. You are unbearably pushy. Please, wait a second. Hello. How can I help you? My name is Alfred Walsh. I'm so honored to meet you, Mr. Fogg. I'm standing before the man who circumnavigated the Earth in only 80 days. I've never embarked on that trip, Mr. Walsh. Are you serious? I've never circumnavigated the Earth. 
I wagered twenty thousand pounds I would with my friends over at the Reform Club. But I've never even left London. Why on earth not? I don't know. Suddenly, I lost interest in money, travelling, and human progress. Hm? This must be Oblivion's fault. You might not have travelled around the whole world, but you're still an expert in means of transport. Ugh. I lost interest in those two. I understand. Nevertheless, I need your help. Help me build a hot air balloon. No, I'm not going to help you. I used to be selfless, but now I can't even remember what that means. Go away. I can't bear talking to you anymore. How weird. He looks like he's been hypnotized. This must be Oblivion's fault. Once again, I think I need to ask Merlin for his wise insight. <laughs>